good morning guys and welcome back to a new vlog um it's currently 7 a.m now i just woke up um i'm gonna eat my breakfast and then I'm, go i'm gonna head off straight to the gym because um usually i would uh eat breakfast after i went to the gym but today I, uh, it's gonna be a very 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 busy day at work so uh, i really want to be at the office at nine and start work right away because since i'm gonna be so busy i won't be able to afford start a bit later what i usually do on a fridays because usually usually on fridays it's not that busy but today it's gonna be very 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 busy um and i also have my hair appointment at five. Oh, also i can finally show you guys i got my helix pierced and i'm so 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 happy with it and i also got a second lobe obviously getting pierced did hurt but not actually too much in my opinion because I heard from a lot of people that it hurts so much and so I was actually so scared when I got in because mind you this was my very first time to get getting pierced apart from my first lobes obviously but this was actually the very first time so she started with the helix first and then she was like okay take a deep breath Boop. then she went right in of course it then hurt but like then the pain was like gone in a second it's just something I just had to bite through and then also the same with my second low, which hurt a bit less. Um, actually, my helix doesn't hurt at the moment. It only hurts when I like uh, try to sleep and lay my head on it. And I, obviously I cannot like uh, sleep on this side anymore because it's really hurting. Because then I have to sleep on the other side. But um, for the rest, it doesn't hurt throughout the day or something. So I'm so very, very happy I got it. Like, it's just basic like this just basic jewelry i just put on like maybe in six months i want to replace it with like a ring so but i'll just have to see about that if you've checked my last vlog you would have known that i was i was getting very sick i'm actually still not feeling feeling better to be honest i still like suffer from a sore throat um, my ear is still closed for a bit but again it's not covid um maybe it's the change of the weather because um the weather has been crazy lately because last week it was like two degrees and now it's like 12 degrees celsius by the way and so of course like a lot of people get sick because because of the sudden weather changes so uh oh yeah uh, with the helix appointment i actually wanted to vlog a lot more of it but everything just went wrong when i was on my way to the appointment because I wanted to go with the car but the, the engine didn't start so i was like crap i have to go with public transport and i had to go all the way to rotterdam because the piercing shop i went there was in rotterdam so i went, had to go with the train on my way my tram which goes in the city also like there was a delay or something so i had to rush very quickly to get the train and luckily i made it on time and i also grabbed a sandwich real quick at the station because i did want to get pierced on an empty stomach since the traveling was so hectic and, and uh, stressful i just didn't have time to vlog anything and obviously at the appointment you're not allowed to like i was by myself first of all and of course i couldn't film at the appointment itself so i couldn't film myself actually getting pierced so yeah the only clip i have is me showing you guys my piercing but yeah so basically that was it what happened okay so i'm gonna go eat my breakfast real quick and then i'm gonna take the bike to uh the gym and then i'm gonna go to the gym Okay, so I hope no one's gonna walk in while I'm talking. Um, I had a very quick workout though, like only 20 minutes because I really have to be at work at nine. So, and I also came with the bike so I could skip on the cardio. So that's great, I'm gonna bike home. It was a good workout, just very short. Um, just basically they trained my arms and uh, my shoulders for a little bit. But like I said, I couldn't train much uh, longer because I had to go to work. So, so yeah, I just want to bump in. Thank you. 
oh it's nice and sunny okay so my down bass literally barely vlogged today because i got at the office at nine and then i literally started work right away and now it has been 4 p.m and i've been working non-stop like barely had time to even eat my lunch so i just was like eating it very quick and then on the way i was so busy like i am exhausted and i still even have to write reports but i'm gonna do that on monday because i my my brain is just fried luckily i did like, like make make notes during my work so i know what to write in the reports it's just my brain is gutted i cannot and i now cannot wait for my hair appointment which is at five so then i can just relax and just get my hair done and cut so yeah i am so tired oh by the way this is um my work car because maybe you guys get confused since i said this morning that that the car didn't work so and i uh took the bike to go to the gym this morning so um but this is literally my work car so um yeah i'm gonna drive back to the office now and then just like call it quits for the day because i am so tired um i was even considering to like uh, push back my appointment to 6 p.m but like no i'm just no i'm just tired I, i'm just so tired <laughs> but i promise i'll vlog more uh, probably at the hair salon and also when i get home so yeah just wanted to give you guys an update because i did such a terrible job with vlogging but i just want to tell you guys that work just literally fried my brain and i'm so tired <laughs> i am home now i am so tired i actually have a headache right now but um yeah i went to the hair salon to get my hair e even more cut and i actually really love how it looks like the last time i went to short was like five years ago i think but i am so obsessed with it like <laughs> i really like it so and it's really a whole vibe with the helix piercing and everything new me you know so I'm also so hungry, I'm gonna make some ramen because I'm craving ramen. And by the way, I know I've only showed how I make my ramen in my videos, but I promise I really can cook. I can cook, okay? So let me know if you wanna see more videos on how I uh, cook things because I, I don't make extravaganza things, but um, I can cook. So <laughs> yeah, but I'm really craving noodles at the moment. Also, I got this package like i think it's like a gift package I, it's not something i've ordered so let me see what it is oh ah it's a box of chocolates like i don't know if it's like a dutch thing but th this kind of chocolate box from mercy we always give it to like people who it's either their birthday or when they're leaving because a colleague of mine is actually uh, gonna leave for another job uh, next month so I guess that's why she sent this so um, there's also this letter I'm not gonna read it out loud because I think it's personal oh wait it's, it's not from my colleague I thought it was from my colleague but um, it's from my um, intern like back in like uh november until last month i had an intern with me uh because we also, also take interns um so i was uh, guiding an intern and apparently she sent me this unfortunately she had to quit due to uh, personal circumstances but um i really didn't expect her to send me this i'm it, it's actually so sweet uh I re i'm gonna set uh text her but thank you like i didn't definitely did not expect this i don't even i didn't even get her something which i feel so bad about maybe i should yes i should no I, now i feel bad the thing is like i'm the worst with gifting people things so um i should get i should get her something like a gift card or something so i should do that oh my god but this is so sweet i thought it was from my another colleague but it's from my former intern very sweet oh yeah also i got some another good news um, okay, so back in 2020, I was supposed to go to 80s, their uh, concert in Amsterdam, a part of their world tour, but 
uh, unfortunately COVID ruined it and there um my memory card was full so i had to delete some stuff i really need to buy another memory card i totally forgot okay back so back in 2020 uh, 80s was supposed to perform here in amsterdam for their world tour but unfortunately covid ruined it and their uh new date was supposed to be last february but then the omic omicron uh strain of the virus ruined that and now today i got an email that their new date is gonna be in may on the 12th of may and i'm so so excited because i actually got vip tickets for 80s so i was supposed to like meet them after the concert like there, there it was supposed to be a high touch but i think because of covid they like changed it but we could still see them anyway and it's literally two days before k-pop flex and i'm so so excited because um that week is gonna be amazing, like 80s concert, and then two days later I'll be in Frankfurt for K-pop flex. Like, I am so excited. Like, I'm very excited. So I really hope COVID doesn't ruin this again. Like, I'm so sick and tired of COVID ruining stuff, y'all. Like, it's not fun. Yeah. Oh, I still actually still need to do a lot of things this afternoon. Like, I need to finish my Korean homework. I already uh, did the workbook and textbook part of the homework, but um. My uh, teacher, my son Seng Nim, um, also uh, asked us to write a five uh, sentence self introduction in Korean, but I still have to email that. And also, I have to learn some vocabulary because we're gonna have this mini quiz tomorrow and I still haven't learned it. So, I need to do that uh, this evening. So, but I'm so tired, but I have to. And do some more planning for this weekend i'm definitely not gonna like do anything this weekend i'm not gonna i don't i don't think i'm uh i'm not gonna plan on seeing friends i think because i'm just so tired from this week so then um yeah so <clears throat> i guess i'm gonna cook my food now <laughs> So I finished eating, I uh, did my, I finished my Korean homework, I mostly did it on my phone because uh, I just find it easier to use the Korean uh, keyboard on there compared to the, compared to on my laptop, I still have to get used to that. As you can hear, I still haven't really fully recovered, <coughs> so I'm so sorry about that. Um, <coughs> I just did my hair in a ponytail, like it sort of looks cute even though my hair is shorter. So this is how it looks like loose. Ah, I feel my helix. It doesn't, luckily things from the helix, it doesn't hurt. It's just when I touch it, I'm like, ah, so. Those two little pieces come loose, but that's fine. This has a vibe. I do like it. Oh, my helix. Ah. Okay, so yesterday I got another mail and I'm not gonna open it. Well, I am gonna open it. It's just not on camera because I know what these are and I'm actually planning to do a K-pop merch haul and I'm actually gonna film a K-pop photo card binder tour next week but I don't think I'll include these in the binder already because uh, I'm gonna film the binder tour before the K-pop merch haul so yeah, stay tuned for that. Uh, I still have like quite a headache though it's just this week has been so hectic and especially today because today was just oh my god I just literally worked my ass off um my brain is just fried so 
yeah i just really want to relax and that's why i think i'm gonna end the vlog here thank you guys so much for watching give the thumbs up if you liked and of course subscribe let me know what kind of videos you like to see more from me and then i'll see you guys next time in a new video oh and i don't know if i've said this before may so maybe i'm repeating myself again but um i am gonna do a week in my life but it's not just literally every single week anymore especially with the last week of my life i felt so overwhelmed and i want to upload uh one at least one vlog a week it's going to either be a day in my life or a week in my life and with with week in my life it's just i have to pick up the camera every single day if, and if i'm going to do that every week then i just won't ha have a break from vlogging and sometimes i just want to take some breaks from vlogging like the past couple of days i didn't vlog and, and it felt great to not be constantly focused on filming stuff vlogging stuff having content you know so yeah so there are gonna be week in my life but it's just, just not every single week so sometimes it's gonna be a day, a day in my life like this so thank you guys for the love and support and i'll see you guys next time in a new video bye bye